Welcome back to Judo Breakdowns, your source for judo commentary on the internet. And what I have for you today is a match from the Grand Slam in Hungary, 2022, uh, in the women's under 52 category. Uh, in white, we have Gafin Primo from Israel. And in the blue, we have Masha Balhaus from Germany. And this is the bronze medal match. Uh, they've already gotten going. Okay. And uh, Masha with the Uchimata attempt. Uh, quite easily blocked by Geffen, so Let's see what's going on. All right. So right now we're seeing the same side grip going. Okay. And another Uchibara tip by Masha. You know, I don't love having that leg across like you saw before she did the Uchimata that the, the her right leg was on the on uh, Geffen's right leg I don't like that I think it's doesn't benefit you really as much as you might feel oh okay here we go nice attack is it like almost like a Kosoro Gake right and uh, the butt really didn't get anywhere I think that's what it was Okay, yeah. Really, it's all been Masha attacking, so it's not too surprising that uh, Gavin's getting the, p the penalty for being passive. And now, let's see if uh, she ramps it up. Okay, she sort of went for an Osoto there, but then turned, like, didn't really go all the way. Okay. So we're seeing the left-handed grip from uh, Geffen. Let's see what... Uh, doesn't seem to be bothering uh, Masha too much. This is another Uchimata attempt. I mean... Let's look at, you know, these Uchimata attempts. What's missing is the the, the pulling of uh, the body. Like, loading the body into it, right? Like... Mm, hard to do what if you're relying the on the legs to do so much work especially if the person's that overly bent over if they're more vertical oh i don't like that that's gotta be penalty in my book okay i don't know what that is that's not a false attack maybe being too defensive i don't know it's i think that's probably what it is but uh okay nice uchi a little shallow, which is why Geffen's able to get away from it. And uh, I don't know if uh, like the timing was a little late, is, is what I would say about that. All right, so now we're seeing a cross grip from Masha. Uh, okay, nothing. All right. And now we're, now we're seeing the counter by Geffen there with the left Uchimata. And... Uh, the Tanya Toshi, I guess, is is what uh, Masha was was trying for. Although it's tough to do when you're far away, at Tanya Toshi, right? So uh, you got a lot of distance to clear. Yeah, see, again, the same issue with the Zuchimata. There's like almost no like if you look at uh, Geffen's right shoulder, that hasn't turned an inch, right? So you know. The only way to throw then is to rely fully on the uh, leg to get the ro all the rotation in. That's just difficult to do unless you're a lot stronger than someone. Maybe she's that much stronger. I don't know. But I kind of doubt it. <laughs> you got you to gotta, you gotta get into it. Okay. Okay, so uh, now Masha's gotten penalized for... Stepping outside the uh, area. She's really up against it now. All right. And uh, once again, tries for another Tanya Tosh. Don't like to see... If you're going to do a Tanya Tosh, your, your bump's got to hit the ground. You know what I'm saying? Like, it can't be like six inches up like that. All right. Uh, 
Oh. Although, okay, so it's the same problem, right? And I, regardless of what happens, even if Masha wins this, like I think she should look back at this this match and and try to workshop the Uchimata more. Um. Uh, also, really, it's not working right, like at all. So why why keep going to this well? There's got to be more in in here. Like, you're grabbing onto the same side, Geffen's left side, but you're going to attack with what off of that? You're going to attack Tanyatosh? Yeah, it doesn't make sense to attack. Yeah, see, the Uchimata, see, the Uchimata will never work that way. It's like trying to close a door from the hinge side, okay? Like, it, like you could if you were extremely, like, strong. Oh, the bear hug. Oh, she got reversed. And it's a hold down. Tani, uh, uh, not Tani, uh, Tateshio got it to me. The Osakomi's called. And, oh, this is gonna be over, folks. Like, yeah, this is over. Yeah, doesn't even try. Um, uh, disappointing, of course, to, uh, to see that. But, uh, you know, I don't think the way it was going, unless Gaffin really messed up, uh, Penalty wise, it was going the way for Masha. Like, just her attacks were just not very credible. So, and uh, you know, she paid the price here in, in terms of this, in terms of the reversal, right? So let's have a look at this again. Okay, here she comes in. I don't know how legal this is anymore because that bear hugs wasn't legal. But okay, whatever. A tiny touch is like this. Look at the amount of, okay, so, I don't know what's going on here. She's wrapped the leg, fine. But there's, if you look at this posture from Gaffin here, right, like, there's, which way are you trying to take her? This way? This way? Over here? You know, like. What's gonna drive her there, really, right? Like, um, normally, if you're gonna, I don't know, the target zone, it's real 50, like the problem, okay, what I'll say is, the problem with this attack is that it's a real 50-50 type of situation, right? Like, you know, um, you're both sort of heading there together. And it's, it's perilous because sometimes that can be uh, turned right up against you, which is exactly what happens here, right? And, you know, I've seen that be called Ipon's, uh, Ipon right there. Now, the Tate Shio, uh, Gatame, you know, it's a tough one. She got the legs wrapped, so, uh, bridging is gonna be difficult at this point. She got it, and to Geffen's credit, she got into it, like, right away so that's that's really good uh from her side you know um the weakness of uh tatashio is is always gonna be um you know if you can if you can find a way to bridge into a shoulder like into the shoulder that's uh exposed and like in this case it looks like the left left shoulder Try to bridge this way, but you know, Masha doesn't sh show any sort of desire to get out of this hold down. So you know, I don't know how much it's really sort of wasted effort, really, right, to talk about it. But whatever. I mean, she's not watching this. <laughs> like, uh, but for anyone that is watching this, you know, that's my thoughts on it. So, um, but tough though. It is tough because she uh, Gaffin really transitioned to it very nicely. So uh, good for her. So those are my thoughts. If you have your own thoughts you'd like to add, please leave a comment. If you enjoyed this video, hit like, subscribe. Um, that's always appreciated, and comments are always appreciated. And until next match, have a great night.